Hey everyone, my name is the Theme Park Evangelist. Well, as you can clearly tell, this is not Cincinnati Northern Kentucky International Airport. I'll get to that in a minute. Uh, if you uh, don't mind, there is a uh, subscribe button that should hit, pop up at the bottom right-hand corner of the screen. Just uh, do me a huge favor and go ahead and tap or click that button right now. Also, make sure you give this video a like um, when you're done with it or at any given time. And also, uh, feel feel free to leave a positive comment below. Anyway, so I am currently at my work, uh, the Creation Museum, which I am actually officially coming back to working at full-time hours in 17 days on Monday, March 11th. It's a little bit on the cooler side today after all the uh, spring-like weather we've been having, but it still feels absolutely amazing. Uh, it is currently Saturday, February 24th, 2024, and... Um, I was uh, originally uh, keeping today closed for YouTubing due to the fact that I was under the impression I was going to be working at Perfect North today, and I also want to keep it open in the, or, sorry, closed in the event that uh, the Creation Museum did need me today, and for a change, neither job need me today, and today is my first Saturday off literally in over a month, and uh, I was originally talking to this, um, one guy I was uh, going to hire as my um, publicizer, and I told him I wasn't going to be able to YouTube on this during the weekend, and I meant that, but that was before I found out that I wasn't going to be needed. And of course, Perfect North has a tendency to just not contact you if they don't need you, and if they do need you, they text you, or they'll even go as far as texting you 24 hours at least in advance to say, hey, don't bother coming in. And in this case, I just didn't hear from them, meaning don't bother coming in to help out or anything. I wasn't even scheduled this weekend at Perfect North anyway. I just like to come in and help out. So anyway, um, I have been wanting to come out to either the Creation Museum and the Ar or the Ark Encounter for quite some time just to show you guys all the uh, construction going on during the winter time months before it gets busier again. And uh, obviously today is a good day to do it with it being a little cooler out and a little quieter for that matter. And uh, Saturdays are generally pretty quiet days around here at the Creation Museum on like on the weekdays. Uh, we are almost done with the wintertime hour. So uh, if you really want to enjoy the quiet, now is your chance to do it. And as you clearly see, I don't have my sunglasses on. Is it because it's not that bright out? Nope. Uh, I am allowing Katie to borrow my car today. Uh, she is working at the Ark Encounter today for Photo FX second week in a row. Next Saturday is her third week in a row working over there while I'm out of town. Actually, a week from today, I am going to be vlogging at SeaWorld Orlando. So, it's funny. I'm going from Northern Kentucky to SeaWorld <laughs> in just a week. But... Uh, that's what us YouTubers do. But uh, I, n I am very, very confident that this is the last vlog I'm going to be able to do until Tuesday. But you never know what could happen. Especially when your uh, other job is not able to schedule as many people because it already feels like spring out here even though it's late February. All right, let's turn this camera around and let's keep on going. So obviously I will have to be mindful that my uh, phone did not get charged last night. And that was my choice. So my phone is currently down to 36%. So I don't have a ton of battery, but I have enough. So this is where uh, Pavilion 4 was. This is one of the original areas where they were doing the, uh, uh, whatever you call it, the uh, living nativity before they moved it indoors. You can see off in the distance the new children's zoo coming in, uh, the butterfly conservatory. But um, everything is looking really good. Uh, currently, there is no zoo right now. There is not many places you can walk around out here. Katie is trying to call me. I don't know why. I was uh, under the impression that she was working at the moment, unless they sent her home early because it's slower today. Unlike last Saturday, it was a holiday weekend, so it was very busy, but uh, things have changed a little bit. 
since last Saturday. So, uh, this YouTuber or subscriber of mine, I bet he won't stay subscribed for much longer. Uh, he had liked my Facebook page, I know that for a fact. He, um, basically had the audacity to private message me last night that I don't care about my YouTube channel, I don't work on it. And I was so hurt uh, after I, you know, did away with him, you know, in a biblical way, of course, that I, um, decided that, um, I should reach out to everybody on my Facebook page. So, as you can clearly see, there's more construction going on over here. And, uh, I just let everybody know all at the same time, hey, um... You know, I get it that I need to work on my YouTube channel more. I really do. But at the same time, I'm getting ready to get married in the next year. And then eventually I'm going to have kids. I don't know how much longer I'm going to be able to keep this YouTube channel up for. But, you know, goodness knows I'm going to do my best to keep it up as long as I can. I mean, I'm right... I'm outside right now in 34 degree weather and it feels like 20 with the wind and I have no gloves on whatsoever and I'm trying to hold a cup with soda in it so my hands are absolutely freezing right now but and that's another reason why I want to kind of wrap this up quickly but um yeah as you can see they have a uh, lot of dirt just piled up right now Obviously, this is not an ideal day to be outside. Um, but regardless. So, because of the fact that I am uh, going out of town soon, and my brother is actually going to Washington, D.C. for the first time in 19 years, give or take. Um, literally the day after I get back. Um... I decided that the uh, best case scenario would be for me to um, go over to his place tonight, not too far from here and where my parents live, and go and spend the night with him. I actually got permission in advance before I just did that, obviously, but I think it would be nice, especially since... Katie is uh, having a friend over tonight, and she doesn't want to cancel, even though she knows I'm going out of town soon. So, even though I got a commentary going on, I am still showing all the construction that is going on right now. I still cannot believe that was all zoo. So, if you are interested in seeing any of the animals right now um, that normally are here at the Croatia Museum. The smaller animals are shown every Wednesday through Saturday in the afternoon, usually on the lower level. And uh, they do have one show a day. They usually show um, two different animal shows with two different themes. They still have some Christmas stuff up, as you can see, but they're still working on getting it down. they still got a couple more weeks left. And, um, I'm going to just show a little bit more over here. Then, of course, their larger animals are currently over at the Ark Encounter right now. So, it's completely up to you what you are interested in doing. So, uh, just keep in mind that this, uh, major zoo, um, overhaul or whatever you want to call it, is going to be completed by the early to mid-fall of this year, 2024. But this is supposed to be huge. This is supposed to be, put um, the Creation Museum Zoo on the same level as the Arcs Zoo. Maybe not quite as big still, but they'll have their own stage, which I think would be awesome. Still utilizing Legacy Hall, of course on colder days like today. 
So, anyway, um, that is my main update over here now. I'm going to put the phone away for now, see what Katie texted me, and try to keep my hands warm until I can get to a different section where I can show you guys some more uh, interesting things that have been going on. All right, on to a new section. Uh, this is definitely going to be one of my shorter museum vlogs, but that's okay with how cold it is today. I don't think anybody would be crazy enough to be out here. Still one of the uh, best photo places. Even on a cold day like today. Of course, the uh, verge is a little wet, so I'm trying to be careful so I don't go, whoops. So TJ was uh, texting me earlier, and he was letting me know that tomorrow, Sunday, February 25th, is his last day of work before he starts vacation. Now, he starts a day before I do, but he's always off on Mondays because of bowling. And uh, as of right now, I'm supposed to be working, but uh, with over 60 degree weather coming in, they could change their minds and text me and say, don't bother coming in. But hopefully they'll at least tell me, um, let's say tomorrow afternoon, tomorrow afternoon, evening, at the absolute earliest that they don't need me. I doubt I can get a new physical that soon, but that would be nice. And that way, I don't have to worry about going over there on um, Tuesday morning. All right, let's do another slip hazard bridge. This is my favorite one to go across during uh, Christmas town. As you can clearly see, the lights are still up. I feel like I'm one of the only ones out here, other than a mother and her daughter I saw. I'm just gonna take two. Decide which one later is the best. I don't usually get to take, you know, the greatest photos on this bridge because there's always people going across it, but on a day like today, no. Woo, I am swaying back and forth. And I know some of you people are probably thinking of a song right now, but I'm not gonna sing it. Okay, I got it that time. See, uh, for those of you who do not know me, when I'm out here vlogging at the Creation Museum, this is one of my favorite photo spots. Despite how freezing I am, I am not passing up an opportunity to take some great pictures. And then I just go through later and I decide which ones I like the best. Oh, trust me, by tomorrow it's going to be a high of 55. But of course, the Creation Museum is closed Sunday through Tuesday because of the winter hours. So this is my only chance. 
Yeah, for whatever reason on uh, the weekends, the weather's been kind of interesting. And then during the weeks, it's been very warm. And then I was looking at the uh, forecast for uh, next week. And it's supposed to call for uh, rain for several days straight. So, yeah, go figure. Well, I'm going to go ahead and uh, end this vlog in the car. And uh, if I get a chance to continue uh, Monday, then I do. If I don't, I don't. Because you know you guys will definitely see me Tuesday through uh, the following Monday. And uh, I'm looking at uh, filming approximately 15 vlogs, so I hope you guys are ready. Okay, I'll be honest with you, that was the quickest trip I have ever had to the Creation Museum. I was so cold, I felt like my fingers were going to fall off. I was like, <laughs> yeah, more or less. So, anyway, uh, due to the fact that... Um, Oh, okay, my parents are already back, but regardless. Um, so, I am going to go home. I am going to go uh, get everything ready for uh, this evening when I go to my brother's place. I'll text back Katie really quickly and um, get my phone plugged in because right now I don't have a charger for it. And then... I am going to get this video uploaded, or well, edited, and then uploaded to YouTube. And then, um, if I have the opportunity to vlog again later, I will. If I have the opportunity to vlog again tomorrow, I will. And the same thing with Monday. But in the meantime, I will definitely see you guys next Tuesday at the airport. So... I guess the best way to um, end this vlog is just by letting everybody know. Uh, right now, everything is up in the air right now just because the Creation Museum is in slow season right now because it's the winter. And Perfect Narf is unfortunately in slow season because of the fact that we're having an early spring. But at the same time, it's still the winter hours. So... They're still forced to stay open, and the Creation Museum museum does not switch back to normal operation until March 11th. So, in the meantime, always remember, you can do all things through Crisis Strengthens You. Have a great day. Peace out.